hello, sports fans. Larry Eater, Doha, Qatar. It's the Run Blog Run podcast. It uh, we're doing a preview of day three, uh, which because of the lateness of both day one and day two, doesn't start till um, yeah 8 p.m., which is 10:05 uh, in California, 12:05 in Fort Atkinson, Wisconsin, and in New York City it's 1:05. We start with the heats to the men's 200 meters. That's going to be interesting. Right after the 100 meter final, which was the night before. <clears throat> Women's pole vault final at 8.40 in the evening. Still a little warm. We'll see how they do. The women's 100 meter semifinals is at 10.20. No, 9.20. I'm sorry. And uh, then the men's triple jump final. Um, it'll be at 9.45, Christian Taylor, Will Clay, Omar Craddock. Be some surprises, always are. Um, our, our friend from Portugal, who's got to be 43, let's see what uh, he can do. Men's 800 meter semifinal. This is going to be a tough race. This will be a terribly tough race. Um, the women's 100 meter final will be at, uh, wow, 11.20 local time. And then the final event of the evening at uh, 11.30, women's 20K race walk. Now, they're not doing this to keep you guys up late. They're doing it for safety. It's going to be hot as hell. It's hot as hell already in lovely Doha, and it's only 5, 12 a.m. right now. So this is Larry Eater with Run Blog Run signing off. This is our preview of day three. Watch for our coverage on runblogrun.com, uh, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and we'll be doing previews and we'll be doing post-event analysis because I know you dig it. And make sure you're checking out the IAAF website as well. Larry Eater, Run Blog Run, signing off.